going on YouTube? How you guys doing? So I just wanted to make a video mostly talking about the uh, serratus anterior uh, which is the muscle right underneath the armpit here lat in front of the lat um, I'll throw up a picture of it uh, it's it's like the the gills or the the striations that people see on the side of their abs obliques high obliques um, I just had a buddy buddy of mine do a, a physique competition and I was looking at you know pictures of the other guys who were in his class and uh, a lot of people don't not a lot I shouldn't say that some people don't have like those muscles at all like there's just no nothing there um, so I kind of wanted to make a video just talking about that muscle because uh, I'm not one to toot my own horn but I feel like I have some pretty good uh, serratus muscles um, and I got some good shots when I did the photo shoot of them so I'll throw those up probably as the main photo for this uh, video as well as I'll throw all the pictures up in the video so you can see more of it if you want um, <clears throat> but those muscles I, if anybody doesn't know how or you know what they do they're mostly for protraction and retraction of the shoulder blades so anytime you're reaching forward pulling back it's more of just the pushing forward the protraction side of it uh, retraction is more like rhomboids shoulder blade back of the shoulder blades um, but it attaches from the uh, front side of your scapula and comes around and attaches to the ribs and that's those are the attachment points that you see when guys are like really shredded and you can see those little those little like fingers there um, I think they just look awesome like they're one of my favorite muscles definitely not a very functional muscle they look good though they're aesthetic um, so for me when I learned about like what they did and how you're supposed to you know work them more I was like eh, that's kinda silly cause because the movement is protraction of the shoulder blades it's only like a two or three inch range of motion you're not moving very far so I would go to uh, my gym and you know I'd be doing push-ups and basically all you're doing keeping the arms locked drop your body down and then push your body back out so you're dropping down uh, maybe like like I said two or three inches um, you know you can also do that on the bench if you want grab the barbell just make sure everything's pinned back drop it back press it straight out the issue with that and that's not really much of an issue unless you're uh, you know not what not wanting people to watch you while you're working out but that's the one thing I was worried about is you know people are gonna come up and be like yo what are you doing like doing like quarter reps on the bench um, so <laughs> that's the only issue with it is if nobody really realizes what you're doing people are gonna think you're just kinda making up your own thing and or not strong enough to do the weight that you're doing uh, so I stuck with push-ups on it and then I would also do it on like machine press so like the like the hammer strength machines you know where you're sitting back handles here so I'd go like a couple reps on the bench and then lock the arms out and just try to really focus on the shoulder blade movement reaching and pulling um, but honestly for me I've been somewhat lucky because I've never really had to do a ton of work on them uh, when I was in high school I used to row I did crew so there's a lot of that motion of pushing and then the pulling as well so I think I got a lot of that from that luckily so I have never really had to uh, struggle through a whole bunch of the serratus exercises in the gym but those are some exercises you can do if you guys are interested in them um, yeah just because personally me personally in my opinion it just makes everything in here come together much better so you have you know the abs and you got all the definition here but then if you just have lats I feel like there's like an empty space in between and it kind of just wraps it all together um, but that's just my opinion. You know, if you guys have opinions, definitely comment down below. Let me know what you think about them. You know, if you have very defined serratus, if not, um, you know, what what exercises uh, you've been doing, if you do have them, and all that stuff. All right, but I just wanted to get the get some information out there in case anybody 
didn't know about them. And I'll put some more pictures and diagrams, more of like the muscle on the body, uh, so you guys can actually see. For those of you who like to actually look and uh, learn more scientifically, um, but that's it for now. I just wanted to talk about that for a couple minutes. Where are we at? Well, we're at about five minutes now. So uh, I will catch you guys later. All right. Comment, like, subscribe. See ya.